big Samsung TV up there is just connected to my computer as a slave screen, one of three screens that I use. And as such, it can you know, display anything that I display on my computer and so using my computer and my VPN and so on. I've been using things like BBC iPlayer, um, but that's all through the computer. With Multimax's new system that is, is routing <coughs> BBC access um, such that it comes from the UK, um, I can now finally use my television on its own using the television's own internet TV facilities. Um, so basically the television now is just plugged into the network. It's plugged into the Multimax network but the computer is switched off um, it's not connected um, and it's not doing anything so you know the computer could not be there at all this is just the television plugged into um, Multimax internet and <coughs> normally at the moment it's saying no signal HDMI 4 because normally that would be the signal coming from my computer but the computer's turned off but this TV has internet TV functionality so on the remote control if I can just show it here I can just push internet and then there's various different applications uh, but if I go to BBC iPlayer again on the remote control and just say OK uh, and fairly soon we get the menu various programs you can scroll through there's the last play just in you can search and so on the search is a bit finicky obviously with the TV remote control you don't have a full keypad um, but if I just select Torchwood, for example, episode 7, and again, it takes it a little minute or two to bring the information in from BBC, and then I can just select Play. It's warning me that it's unsuitable for young audiences. I hit Play Program. Um, you can also set up Parental Guide Lock, and, and the program starts playing. So now I'm, I'm back, you can't see me, but I'm sitting back on my sofa with my TV remote control, uh, computer totally switched off, not doing anything in this situation, just the television connected to the internet connection, um, and as you can see, playing fine, no stuttering, uh, I can control the volume. Abstain hurt. Don't you see the whole world becomes immortal? see that this program is also available in BBC HD. So I'll select BBC HD. Again, it takes it a moment or two. The play option comes up. I select that. Again, it's giving me the warning. I say, yes, I'm not a young audience. I'm able to handle a bit of sex and violence. And off we go. Now this is in full HD. Now you won't see this on the video. Um, because obviously my video recorder is in HD and so on and there's lots of quality costs, but you'll have to trust me, this is now playing an HD stream live just from the television plugged into the internet connection, no computer involved here at all. Look at it, it's not healing. And again, no stuttering. Don't you see the whole world becomes immortal? I'm immortal. I don't mend. I'll leave it running for a few minutes just to kind of prove that you know it's not stuttering, that the bandwidth is able to handle the high definition stream. Um, but basically, yeah, this, this for me is pretty impressive stuff. You can, you can just watch BBC content from here um, without even a computer, just using this television and the internet connection. Um, and not just standard definition, but full HD definition as well. the buttons, you select what you want, and it works. Get your visa, all set. Yes, I mean, thank you very much, Inspector. <laughs> 
heart this way. The bees of mine. You find everything's in order. The British consulate arranged for my travel through the embassy in Rome. That visa belongs to me. Yes, sir. Probably sorry this happened, sir. Take him away. And I'll stop it now, because I'm not going to sit here and watch it while I video myself watching it, if you see what I mean. Anyway, that's a quick demo of, of what's possible with uh, this new Multimax internet connection that I've got, and the fact that it, it handles the, the sort of VPN side of things totally transparently. I don't have to do anything my end. Before, I could kind of do this, um, but it meant connecting the television to the computer and then the computer to the internet just so that I could do the VPN side of things because Multimax are doing that on their side of things and it's totally transparent to me it means now the television can just be plugged straight into the network and doesn't have to be go through the computer at all which kind of would defeat the whole purpose of it so I could put this television anywhere in my house and just need to run uh, ethernet cable to it um, and not need to run you know, a video cable from the computer to the television. I could just run an ethernet cable to the TV and anywhere where I can run that ethernet cable to, the, the, the system will work, as you've seen. Anyway, I hope that's of interest to somebody, and uh, that's me signing off.